Hello everyone, Penguin Cell here again today, and we are back rocking another new demo. This time it's for Finally Diced. Um, I don't know a whole lot about this game, but it sounded like it was kind of like a cool, like you use dice to kind of cook, and that sounded right up my alley, so I've been excited to try this. The developer told me straight up to wait until the new version of the demo came out, which it just did. So we're going to dive in and check out the demo for Finally Diced. A moose bouche edition. Uh, yeah, we'll do a new game. Okay, music's banging a little bit. It might be a wee bit loud. Is there? Can I not go to the settings from here? I feel like the music was a little bit loud. So, let's do something like that. It might be too quiet. I don't know. We didn't actually do anything, so starting a new game is fine. Okay, so let's see. I, I, I'm guessing it's some sort of restaurant management type game, which I actually like these quite a bit. Um, 140 in rent, 110 in wages, so our bills are 250. Bills are paid weekly on Monday. If you can't afford them, you lose. Okay, so I'm wondering if this is a... I'm wondering if it's like a luck be a landlord, you know, crop rotation style, make your wages off of random things or die so it said something about bills okay first day at the job well let's just start this is telling us to start welcome you must be the new head chef let's show you around thanks this is one of our kitchen hands feel free to introduce yourself by clicking them this by selecting a die in the workspace you can see what tier each of its faces are okay these are all circles this dies all zeros, which isn't very useful. Let's change that in the management screen. <laughs> what the heck? It seems like these ingredients have expired. Start by dragging them aside. Expired ingredients die, die, die. Great, now that you actually see the dies frame, it'll fetch you some new ingredients. Okay, get this out of here though. Go away, go away. Drag the new ingredients onto the frame. Okay, that looks like a sweet potato. Mushroom. Rice. Okay. Can I rotate or no? Can I rotate? It's looking like no, which means I can't. Oh, no, I can't. I can do this. Okay. Click on preview to see your die in the workspace. Select your die and notice how it's changed. Okay, so it's got a bunch of tier 1s. By overlapping dice with ingredients, you assign the ingredients tier to that dice face. Gotcha. You will encounter more potent ingredients as you gain reputation as a chef. Click manage to alter your die further or select let's cook when you're ready to move on. Let's cook, baby. The first job we need to do is some simple cleaning. Once you've rolled your dice, drag that face onto the job to slot it. Requires one faces that contain a one. Bang. Click end round when you're ready to continue. Okay. I did it. Looks like the rest of the crew decided to show up. Now that they're here, we can prepare our ingredients. You must finish at least one job every round, even if it's not done correctly. Okay, I see. So, requires two faces of the same tier to fry mushrooms. Requires one face that adds up to two or under for simmer. Okay. Superterror requires three faces of odd tiers. One, three, and five. So I'm guessing this is what we've rolled. So let's do this. Let's do these. Bang. Preparing a job correctly will grant you score and reputation. Reputation is an innate value based on the ingredient. Score is equal to the sum of all the faces used to prepare that job. If you prepare a job incorrectly, it is considered burnt and not worth, and is worth nothing. Okay, so now we just have sweet potato, which needs... I have to do something, even if it's done poorly, so... Complete! We got five something and twelve something. Money and reputation, I'm guessing. Okay, 
Let's start day two, baby. Another day in paradise. Now that you're up to speed, you can manage all the chefs in our kitchen. Click the toggle between moving items and moving dice. Drag the chefs out of storage and place them on the grid. What is that? Okay, so... It said something about overlapping. Nope. Shun Buyan. Oh, that's the guy's name. Jupiter Ivan. I don't think we can rotate. That's something to consider. So we probably... Let's do something like... Move you over, move you like... That? I don't know what that spot looked. That was weird. This... What the heck is this? Okay, let's move everybody up then. What is this space? There's like some things being left behind. Click the toggle when you're ready to go back to moving items. I guess this is fine. Item shop can be used to purchase new ingredients and equipment. Initially, only tier 1 and 2s will be available. However, as you progress through a run, higher tiers will become more common. Okay, so this is the money we have. We also have to make sure we have enough money. What is this stuff? Delivery. Receive deliveries as a reward for ranking up. Open it for some goodies. Interesting. Cucumber. Okay, so whatever ingredients we have on the dice are the jobs we have to complete, it looks like. Cucumber. Slice. Requires three faces of tiers three and four. That's not good. Requires one face that adds to four or over. That's not good either. Paprika. Add one capacity and five that. Uh, I will take paprika. Yeah, eggplant requires three faces of odd tiers. Spinach appears in deliveries and the shop as a tier two. So this is actually a tier four ingredient, but it shows up as a level two here. Adds two that for each unique face. Requires two faces from tiers five and six. I'm going to take the spinach because that sounds like I don't really fully understand it. A spring onion requires one face from tier one and two. Okay, that seems like doable at least. Requires one face that adds... I can't read that. Requires one face that... I don't. I can't read those. They're too far down. Those are too far down. I'm going to just take the spring onion because I can actually read it. Celery. If this is the only prepared item this round, add six that. Requires two faces of consecutive tiers. Eggplant. Flatbread. Requires one face of even tiers. Does not count towards your total hand size. I'll think of flatbread. What do we got? Lettuce. Appears in deliveries as a tier one. Okay. I'll take a lettuce. I like me some lettuce. A zucchini requires four faces from tiers one and two. That's a lot of faces. Seasoning. When this face is used in a job, apply seasoning. Okay. Flour requires two faces to add up to equal four. That's not bad. I'm not sure what these time things are. It looks like money and like some sort of time. I don't know what that means. Let's apply some seasoning. Okay, so let's get some of this. Let's get some of this in there. Like a little bit like that. I'll give you flatbread. Here, you can have paprika. Oh, because the food stays. So it can be, like, overlapped to be in on multiple people's die. Very interesting. Can I, like, trash this? I don't think I need the uh, expired stuff. Okay, so I can, like, buy stuff. Cursory odd. What if I buy a mushroom? Sold. Preview. Yeah, some of these are still empty. Some of these are empty, which I feel like is kind of bad. Let's go back here. I feel like we want these to be as not empty as possible. Like, we can do like a that and a this. These are at least relatively full. Um, Let's ride. Okay, so we have five jobs, and we have rolled, we rolled a zero, which is, zero is probably bad, I assume. 
Job does not count towards your total hand size. I mean, you could probably put the zero in there then. Since it didn't do anything. So we have one, two, three, four, and zero. Well, we need stuff for the same tier, which is lame. This isn't good. Our rolls for these were quite bad. Ba -da -boo, ba -do, boo, boo. Okay, so our rolls were pretty bad. Objectively, pretty bad. Let's just do something like this. Yeah, I gotcha. Of course, one face from one or two. Okay, so. Once again, not really good rolls. This song bangs, though. What if I do like a that? Is that good? No. For some reason, that gave us nothing. We're getting a lot of zeros, man. Do zeros count as being the same tier? I don't know. Requires one face that adds up to two or under. How about zero? How about this? Apparently zeros are absolutely useless. A zero doesn't count as anything. Okay, we did get three odds though. Bang. Oh. Requires four! I thought it was three. Why is it four now, man? That was a horrible day. Okay, we need to get rid of every f fucking zero, man. No, I wanted to manage. Okay, I, I didn't... Oh, something something died. Go to that. Okay, I need to buy everything. Because we, we need to maximize no zeros. Zeros are really bad. Zeros appear to be really, really bad. We still have a bunch. Oh, we have a tomato. Um, do this. Do that. Do that. Let's cook. Because zeros are apparently just the worst thing in the world. Okay. Requires three odds. Requires three odds. Requires that. Requires four. Okay, how about we just do three odds? Bang. Nice job. We got a zero. You know we love zero. Let's see. We can do requires three odds again. So one, two, three. Is there anything I want to just get rid of? Not yet. Not yet. We're doing it. We're doing stuff. Okay. Requires one face from three to four. Requires... Okay, these are great. These are great. So we can give you a three. We can give you all of these. Bang. Now that's a turn. The kitchen's heating up. Heat has added to the reputation of every job you complete. Gain heat by preparing multiple jobs in a single round. Your heat will decrease by one at the start of every round. Nice job, us. Let's go. Okay, let's see. So we got some good rolls. Requires three evens. No. Requires one face to add to two or under. Maybe. Requires one face from that. Okay, possibly. That adds six seasoning. Okay, so what if I do... We don't have three evens, but we can do... A tier one adds up to two or under. How about we just do this? We add some seasoning. Bang. Okay. Season. I don't know what the seasoning thing does. Maybe it doesn't give us anything but this. We need three evens. We didn't get that. Doesn't count. Requires two of the same tier. Okay. We'll get, let's go with that and that. We'll do that. We ride. I don't understand why some of these go to zero. Requires three evens. Of course it does. Of course it requires three evens. Why wouldn't it? Complete. 
Okay, that seemed like a better day overall. We are nowhere close to being able to pay these bills, though. Events. Equipment delivery. Okay. Bills are due. Oh, no. I was looking the wrong day. I was like, huh? Like, we are not making good money at all. The equipment delivery came in. Choose a frying pan. Used. Roll all dice. I don't... I don't really understand that. So that needs to go. That needs to go. I'm assuming. I'm assuming when these things go stale, they have to, like, die. I don't know what this is. I've got, like, this little hand. That's like, pick me, pick me. Oh, I see. It, it goes... No, I'm not sure I understand. So it's just a two by two in here. Mise en place. Well, we're going to have to buy some more stuff. Or we're Bone City, so... We'll do a little bit of that. This, this is tough so far. Let's see. Requires three odds. Okay, we can do that. Requires one, one or two. Okay. Requires one. Okay, this is great. So I'll hit you with three odds. Oh, no, that requires four odds. I don't have that. I'll give you three odds. I'll give you a tier. That requires four. What the heck? Okay, well, we can do these. Oh, wait. That also requires four. Why does it keep changing? Why does this go up? I don't understand that. Requires three faces of odd tiers. One, two, now it's four. I don't understand that. Why does it change? I guess just get it out of here. I don't understand that. It says three, but then it goes to four. Genuinely confused by that part. That part doesn't make sense to me. The zeros really are useless. Let's see. Because we have three. Okay. That requires three consecutive tiers. So how about like a one, two, three. And now it's four. Yeah, screw you. Screw you, game. We've got that all figured out. Not really at all, but we did it. Three odds. Okay, how about four odds? How do you feel about one, two... Oh, now it's only one, three. I genuinely don't understand that. Genuinely, I don't understand. Requires one face from one or two. Okay, how about, how about this? How about that? Bang. Give us that heat. Our reputation's gotten better. We're not making any money, though. Requires one face adds up to under two. Requires a bunch of evens. That's not going to happen. Um, how about this? And how about that? Bang. I don't understand why that doesn't count towards heat. We did multiple jobs. Well, this one can just die, I guess. Like, the, the seasoning ones, I don't understand. They don't give us any score. Choose one. Milk. Requires three faces that add up to equal seven. When it expires, it becomes ricotta. Oh, that time is how many days until it expires. If blank is prepared this round, add a heat. Rice. Of course, one face, it's two or under. Fine, give me the milk. We can work with Rakota. Okay, see, we're, we're doing good on the... Wait. Oh, no, because we're ranked two now. I was like, we're doing well with the... That. There's no way we're making enough money, though. I don't know how you could possibly make enough money. 
Expired. Yeah, it's not good. Expired ingredient is tier zero and loses all jobs and abilities. You may restock ingredients to refresh their thing for a price. Select the ingredient you wish to restock and then select confirm. That costs 19. That costs just $24 to restock this stuff. Holy crow. Restocking will cost the price of each plus a flat delivery fee. The new frying pan will come in handy. Why? Drag the equipment so that it overlays the hand. Okay. I've been doing that and it does nothing. That doesn't work. It just doesn't do anything. I don't understand that at all. Like, it doesn't seem to work. I was like, can I not put this in storage? I'd like to get this milk in there. I'm not fully sure I understand everything quite yet. If we're being objective. Okay. Requires mm, one of that. Okay, I can give you a three. But then I can't do odds. I can do this. That does nothing. Like, this is going to give me nothing. It says four and five, but it's going to actually give me nothing. I don't understand that. I, I'm not sure I understand. Three dice that add up to equal seven. Okay, how about two, two, and three? Bang. One face that adds up to under two. Or odds. So this four is actually useless, sadly. I, I can't do any of these. I can do this. This was like the worst roll in the history of mankind. Oh, because that's four faces. That was arguably the worst roll in the history of mankind. Okay, we can do our odds. Unless this goes to be stupid-ass four again. It didn't. Thank you. Like, we're not making any money. I don't know how the hell you could possibly get your bills to go. Like, I really want to like this. I just, I don't really understand it. It doesn't always seem like everything is working out right. It could definitely be a me issue, but I'm not sure if it is. Like, some stuff just doesn't always make sense. Um, okay, we can do three odds. We can give you to this. Bang. Let's heat up. Like, I don't know how the hell you're supposed to make any money. Requires one face that adds to two or under. Okay. Requires odds. Requires evens. How about odds? How about that? Heating up again, baby. The heat goes away immediately, though. It requires three evens. Fascinating. Complete. Yeah, I mean, we made $35. And you know we're going to have to spend it. Requires two faces that add to five or over. Requires two faces that add up to equal four. I feel like that's kind of not terrible. I feel like we could make that work. Yeah, I mean, we, we owe $250 at the end of the week. We have not made any money. 
Okay, so I don't need to do all of these. Like, I still understand this frying pan thing at all. Is it, do I need to not have anything in it? Okay, we need to not have anything in it. Equipment items give useful abilities that take effect during the work phase. Only the abilities of held equipment are available to be used. The equipment phases are always usable, so position them wisely. So I don't really fully understand how this wants to be. Can you just go into damn storage? Let's see. Okay, we can do like something like this. Okay. So we needed that in the hand. So I'm not 100% sure. Like if it's supposed to be on the dice faces or if it's supposed to be hanging on. Like... I'm not sure. It looks all right. I don't. I don't fully understand it. Rolls all dice or something like that. We have two uses of it. Requires one low tier thing. Requires odds. Requires them to equal seven. Requires them to equal four. Well, how about we do three odds, and we'll do it that. And we ride. Okay. Like, I'm not sure what the frying pan does. Maybe we can re-roll. Maybe that's what it is. Requires four faces that equal seven we can do. Two that equal four. Odds. Okay, what if... Oh, it requires three faces that equal seven. So... That's sad. So it can't... We can't use the four for that. Means I can't do any of the rest of this. Let's see. Two that equal that we can do. Okay, we can do twos. And we can do consecutive. Bang. There we go. There we go, baby. Whew. The people are loving it. Everyone's going wild. Requires four from one and two. No. Requires one that equals two. Maybe. Requires three evens. No. Requires three odds. Yes. We can do this. We can also do that. Bang. Like, we're making a little bit of money, but nowhere near paying 250. Requires four from one and two. Okay. I can do that. Bang. Let's see. So it requires three evens. No. Frying pan me. Come on. Yeah, three evens. We made use of the frying pan, baby. Let's go. We're getting a lot of this reputation. Holy. I mean, we're, we're, we started making a little bit of money, but there's no way we're going over that. Complete additional cleaning jobs or risk a hefty fee. Today is a day of health inspection, so we need to do a thorough cleaning. Okay, what the heck is this? Bacon. When it's burned, it's worth stuff. A burned job is zero. Huh? But it's worth something when it's burned. Interesting. Of course, three faces of the same tier. Pasta. I mean, zucchini I kind of like. Three evens I don't like that much. Doop, 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 doop. I kind of like the zucchini, but it costs a lot to restock that. We're probably better off doing like a, we'll just buy a bacon. What are these? Consecutives? And that's that seasoning thing. Put that in storage. We need a something that goes sideways. And of course we don't have that. What if we do... This, and then we can buy a sweet potato. We can do that. 
I guess. I'm not sure I understand the cleaning thing. Oh, we have to do the cleaning or we get screwed. Okay, so we need a one or two. We need one face from that. We need three consecutives. Okay. How about one, two, three, and one, two for cleaning? Bang. Easy. Requires two faces that contain threes. Well, I hate that. Double threes, man? Holy. Okay, how about three faces that equal this? Three. Bang. How about burned? Worth seven instead of zero. Okay, how about you just do that then? Can I hold dice in there? Is that what I'm doing? Can you hold dice between rounds? That would have been good to know. So you can hold dice between rounds. But it's stuck in there. That's interesting. Okay, well. You need at least to hold a three. You need two twos. You need two that equal that. Well, I'll just burn the bacon then. That's interesting that you can hold them. Requires three odds. Sadly, I need this. That requires three odds. How about you finish your cleaning? You get that. This requires odds. You can hold of that. Two goes nowhere. Holding dice in between is so good to know. That That's something... That's a my mistake. That's definitely uh, something that's worthwhile. Cleaning requires two ones. That needs odds. That needs odds. That needs odds. I'll finish my cleaning at least. Requires threes. It's all threes and odds, man. Hold that. You hold this. Can I reroll? Okay, I can reroll the remainings. That's nice. We got twos again. Twos are genuinely not helpful. Requires one face. That needs two or under. Okay. How about you get that? How about you do that? How about you do this? Bang. Like now we're rocking. Nice. One, two, three. Let's ride. We still didn't make enough money, but knowing we can hold over dice is pretty useful. I'm surprised they're even letting us pick because I'm pretty sure I'm like dead. I'll take a pasta. Rigatoni and whatnot. We are super dead. The equipment delivery just came in. Your restaurant didn't manage to turn a profit. Maybe the golden arches are hiring? Hey, screw you. Screw you, man. Okay. So, the game's got a lot of promise. I I didn't know we could hold dice between rounds. That would have been cool to know. Um, still, I think earning that much money is going to be hard. Because it adds up the amount of... You gain money by adding up the amount of, like, numbers on, like, your rolls. You use a lot of, like, ones, so you get, like, $2. And then uh, your ingredients expire. So, you either have to spend money to re-up them. Or you have to get rid of them to buy more. Because zeros are useless. You can't have any zeros on the board. So assuming that that rent payment goes up. Or like your bill payment goes up. I feel like it would be really really hard to like be anywhere that's not skating the line. But I do think it's cool. It's got some really good concepts. I'd be interested in trying it again. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, feel free to like the video. Feel free to subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. And you'd like to keep up to date with all the cool indie game demo first looks we do and all the other cool indie game stuff we do on here i appreciate you guys watching this i'll catch you in the next one